Hello, welcome back for our next week of training. Uh, we have the 20th through the 26th, we're going to be going over today. So um, just keep in mind that this, we're under Drew's and Drew um, has training to do on Saturday. We do have the beach workout this Saturday, the 25th, so ignore that. That's Drew's stuff for that he can do on his own. If he's not coming to the beach workout, of course. Uh, so just a reminder, we have the beach workout on the 25th, so uh, we will, gym will not be open. Um, also, quick reminder, I'll be out of town. I'll be leaving uh, next Wednesday, the 29th, which is down here. I'll be back on the 5th the following week, exactly one week from that day, getting married on the 1st. So um, have fun making do without me. Some of you guys will be there with me, which will be awesome. So make sure you guys still train while you guys are there. And yes, I will still coach you within reason. Um, let's go over our training for the week. So I apologize for the typo. I accidentally put 20 double under today. It should be 30. So just keep that in mind for the snatch workout. Um, a lot of you guys have your own accessory work or your own individual training, so uh, we're just going to go over that today. If you guys have any questions on your specifics, please don't hesitate to reach out to me. I'd love to talk with you about it, about your training and your progression. So if you want to know more specifics, please reach out to me. I'd be more than happy to go over it with you. Um, so we have today, pretty simple, uh, 10 chest to bar pull-ups plus 30 double under should be um, 30 instead of 20. And the remainder of time within that minute, you guys do one squat snatch building. They will take a minute off. So remember that this snatch has to be performed within that minute. You can't let it bleed over into the one minute rest, okay? Um, so the goal on this, guys, is to really work, dial in your transitions. Make sure that you're very quick from the bar to the pull-up. Sorry, no, from the pull-up bar to the double under to the barbell in a very short amount of time. Um, I did this workout with noon. It was really good. I really like how the design came together on that one. So name of the game is transitions on this one. On Tuesday, we have our back squats. We're going through a back squat cycle, guys. If you guys need additional back squats so you guys can see how Drew's doing after all these back squats, then um, you will be doing them, or you guys will be doing single leg work every Tuesday. Um, on the back squats, uh, you guys will be doing a tempo 3-0-X-1. You guys will start roughly 70-75% 70, on this for this week, and we're gradually going to progress off this every Tuesday. Um, and then you guys have your individual work either before or after. Uh, same thing with the dead. We're going to be doing a deadlift press um, back squat cycle for everyone, including you guys. Um, that way we can kind of get a solid base strength there. We are going to be testing a version of, um, it's two minutes longer, of the Beach Cities Battle Event 5, I believe it is. And it's two legless rope climbs, four deads. Six box jumps, eight hang power cleans, ten wall balls. You guys can see the loads there. So on this one, guys, go out really hard. Um, it's actually a lot of reps. So um, the workout itself will actually build off in reps, but I want you guys to repeat the same reps just to kind of make sure it's more cyclical because um, as muscle fatigue gets greater, then, um, then yeah. Honestly, I don't like the design of the original workout. I like this a lot better just because it's easier to see and you know how many reps you're doing every time. Adding two reps to everything doesn't really make anything that much that much more fantastic especially because that event is only eight minutes so you're just going to hit a muscle fatigue on that one so i think it's better like this anyways uh, so again same thing we're just testing this workout for the beach cities people who those of you guys who will be going to that it's going to be a really good workout i like this one a lot so i think it should be good uh, make sure you guys hit this one hard it's only 10 minutes so go out hot um and then we're going to be going over on friday uh the strict press we have uh, same rep scheme 753. We're going to be doing a set every two minutes, just like everything else. And then for time, this workout looks like a lot of fun. It's a one mile run, 50 off chain dumbbell snatches, 35 strict hands, and push ups. Um, class workouts are all a little bit different than this, than for you guys, just to make sure you guys don't get clustered with uh, with everyone. So their, their workouts are actually kind of flip flop just to make it a little bit easier um, logistically for the classes. Um, and then you guys, I think, are all doing some sort of a pressing movement to complement the, the handstand push-up, the strict press on there, just to build some volume. And then the weekend, obviously, we have the beach workout. So that's kind of the game plan for uh, this upcoming week. Uh, on September 8th is the Beach Cities Battle. So after that, we're going to kind of switch gears. It's actually be perfect timing for this training cycle. So you guys will hit this all the way through um, the 8th. And then starting on the 11th, we'll have something new on uh, September 11th. I believe. No, September 10th. September 10th, that's when we start a brand new training cycle. So we're going to kind of work off the same theme of the back squats, deadlifts, press. Um, and then we'll probably do the total again somewhere in here, maybe in the 17th, 18th, 19th. You know, we'll see. Uh, but we're going to do some classic benchmarks too. We're actually going to do some comp train benchmarks as well. Some of those workouts look pretty cool and be good to get some new data on some new workouts. So uh, that's the game plan for now. If you guys have any questions about the specifics, please don't hesitate to reach out. Love to work with you guys. 
guys are all doing a great job with uh, all your training so far. Really happy with what I'm seeing. You guys are all asking good questions, sticking with the plan. And so far, I think the energy has been really good. So I want to thank you guys for that. You guys are doing awesome. Keep up the great work.